This is Sarah, and it is Thursday. Tomorrow we take off for Hackaday's Super Conference in Pasadena, but uh, until then, I wanted to squeeze one last gimmick into Noodle to make him a bit more entertaining for the conference, and uh, that is this, uh, I'm gonna call it his Whisper Bubble. And this is a shield or a hat that Mark designed, which fits over the Raspberry Pi Zero and has a uh, tiny little OLED display up there at the top. So anyone at the conference can peer inside Noodle's head and look at this display and see what he's thinking. Probably having to do with socks and beans. I have to uh, pull Noodle's current brain out of his head and uh, install this. So that is the uh, project for the morning while I drink my coffee. So let's get to it. Noodle, you have no no headpiece. You you have eyes and your your roll cage is just sort of sticking up and out everywhere. So I went ahead and I made a little bracket for the shield really quickly yesterday. And um, there are these two kind of standoffy leg things sticking out there. Those are going to mount onto uh, these two holes, one right there and one right here, and this is going to ultimately squeeze right here. Once it's added, um, his brain will then look like this. His brain is like a burger. It's like a it's like a nyan nyan burger, but you wouldn't want to eat this. So Noodle's whisper bubble has been properly installed in his little noggin. You can see the little black rectangle up there. Time to plug. Looks like it's working. Noodle. You own Mars? You want to tap dance? So in the future, this will act as Noodle's status display, and it will be informed by real pieces of data that are influenced by his sensors. But right now, Mommy just made a long list of things Noodle might potentially think. Mars and beans and textures and soft things. They're still Noodle's thoughts because Mommy had them. Whatever. Uh, hopefully I'll see you at Supercon, but until then, as always, keep making awesome things out there, and thank you for watching.